Alrighty, let's play this in full first. Alright, turn off the sound. It's good. I love the... <gasps> With the legs out. Probably just bring out that foot a bit more. So that you have a bit of a cleaner silhouette if you can between the head and the foot. So there's no tangent right there. And then let me check here. I think the biggest note that I have. I think this is okay. Just all that. Just watch out. There's something kind of busy in the mouth where it feels like it's almost like he's chewing something. It's like a frog-like big change in there. But be careful to not have too much going on because the danger is that you have so much going on here and then through there as well. Plus, like slight changes in all of this. I know he's busy playing and everything, but the danger is that it's just everything is moving and there's no focal point. And I think I would just I would just stiffen up the face just there a little bit. So like the main thing that he's doing, like this is busy. Like he's hammering this this joypad while being really concentrated on what's going on there. And then this one. Is cute, but I think you're going too far with the shoulder this shoulder up and down and then suddenly here it goes down and stops and then only the rest here continues but then that's that's kind of locking and then only this continues to move meaning that there's just it's almost like this is disconnected from the rest of the body especially like this the shoulder up and down so be careful with that it feels like this has its own life and it's, it's I think the shoulder that's the biggest culprit there and then timing wise, I would almost go a bit, it's a bit faster on that leg. So again, he's a kid, it's very active playing video games and it's, it's almost like for what he's playing, this move here and how he goes back is almost a bit too casual. Just like tiny, tiny, like speed up in terms of the, the movement there. And how many frames do you have here? One, two, I think this could be, this could be a one frame IDAR. Man, it's probably me having seen the shot so long uh, for so many times for so long. I don't know. I, I would try a one frame version. Just get, get a bit more like, oh, she's coming. Because the danger is that it, it, it's a, it has an ever so slight slow feel. And then this, especially this, rain down and up into that. Watch this again. And what is... To me, it feels too slow for someone who goes, Oh, my mom's here. And then I would stick with... I know we said something about him tracking the mom. But there's something about... <gasps> where this feels a bit like head up and eyes versus... I think you could take a couple frames out of this whole thing. So it's a much faster... <gasps> and in that way, you can <gasps> hold. And then nothing's moving. And then hold that for like eight, nine frames. I don't know if you can. And then you have dart, dart. If that makes sense. And what that does is it's going to calm everything down so that we can focus on, on just this section. Like the horror goes freeze. And then we really understand that he's looking and checking. Because my concern is that it's going to be... And then immediately this. I mean, like it's just a softness about the eyes when you do this where... You're going from this immediately to this. You just want a moment of, oh, and then looking. But without the head down and all the hair. It's just a little bit of a, oh, and then the, the hair can settle. And then you have a dart. Really just the shock gets, gets amplified there. And then you can go into this. And I do love that. That is just super cute. I just cleaned it up in terms of uh, just the silhouette. This one, I think that arm swing is too slow it's almost a bit even in timing and the spacing there 
So you gotta bit of a faster and then watch out like we're stopping this a bit on a dime i think you're okay to go here and then overshoot a bit and come back and not have that locked arm with then only this moves a bit of a yeah a bit fast it just feels a bit slow what's also happening is that this is an action and then this is an action right there and then also looking as it's almost looking to the camera so it's like it's always like three things happening. One, two, three. And I would go. <laughs> and it's almost like, I mean, if you want to even have people concentrate more on this, this could be the moment of. <sighs> and then it's like this moment of maybe staying within a bit more three quarter. And you can close his eyes if you want. Because the moment we don't see eyes, we don't look at the face. We start to go somewhere else. So if you calm this arm down, it doesn't move too much. Close eyes. The eye is just going to go over there. And then suddenly that arm goes down to grab this. That's suddenly another move that's fast, but you know nothing else really is moving. That's the thing that pulls our focus back. And again, the danger is here that you have this happening while the head is going forward, while this is going forward. So if you calm that down, it's just this. Then we can concentrate on that. And then you got that, which is great. Boom. I think that works. I think that worked. That jump is the best jump you've done so far. I think that's really cute. I love all that. That little. I think that is a bit too far. I think you can go with this and bring the toes in or the foot just a bit more. So it's almost like he's trying to crawl forward. It still has a slight feeling of ah. Oh. My legs, I can't move them. And that's cute. But then what I would do is doing all this. Here it would be. But he's got big eyebrows, big expressions. I, you could bring that down, scrunches. He's like, I'm trying. And then just for a big moment. Huh? Oh, hi. Hi, mom. And I would calm that hair down. The hair is a bit too much. Too much floppiness. And I think what you can do here, when he goes here, cheat those eyes a bit more towards us so the pupils are a bit more visible, especially this one. And instead of doing a dart up, I wonder if you could do like, at this very subject, you don't have to do this, but it could be interesting to play a dart. Like he's down looking here. Like, is she still looking? Am I safe? Versus pretending to read. Because we know he's pretending and... You know, like he, he already has that, that little, uh, it's a little bit of a, he's calm, but at the same time, slightly nervous with a little look down. I don't know, there's a thought, bring that out there. I know it's like, yeah, another idea for something you've shown a couple of times, but that is my job. You're paying me to just give you all the information and you can parse this however you want. You can use whatever you want out of all of that. But yeah, it's in good shape. So these are just the current thoughts, all right? Thanks. All right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.